Hey guys, Casey with Spectora here. I've had some questions on TechSport recently about how to add different uh, description texts to multiple choice type comments. So I thought I'd make a video about what the difference between multiple choice and checkbox type comments is and how to kind of achieve that in Spectora. So the basic rule in Spectora is one comment, one text descriptor. So for each different comment, we have a different default text. So within this occupancy, you can see that I have four different multiple choice answers that I can choose. When I have one or more of these answer choices selected, the comment will be activated and this default text will display. In some other softwares, you can have a different text display for each different answer choice. Unfortunately, that's not a thing in Spectora. One comment, one text. So if you would like to achieve that, instead of having a multiple choice type comment, you would create a checkbox type comment with that answer choice, and then you could put the text that you would like specifically for that answer choice within the default text for that comment. So you're still checking a box, it's just instead of being within a multiple choice type comment, you're selecting one of four options. To give you an idea what that looks like, I went ahead and created a sample report. So if I click into edit, so now I'm inside the web report editor instead of the template editor, a report is assigned to a particular inspection. If we scroll into our inspection details where we were just at, you can see that a multiple choice type comment displays like this. And I can select one, two, three, or four, however many answer choices I would like. Now that I have activated that comment by selecting one of the answer choices, this default text will display underneath that comment in the report. If I wanted a different type of description for each one, with my checkbox type comments here, I would select, I would like to show occupied and it is furnished. And now I'll be able to have both of these descriptions for occupancy furnished and for occupancy occupied both display in the report. To give you an idea what it looks like, let's go over to the web report. Now, if I scroll down, to my inspection details, you'll see that this multiple choice type comment has the title of the comment, the answer choice is selected, and then the text within the comment. For the checkbox type comments, we've got the title of the comment, and then the text underneath it. Title of the comment, text underneath it. Hopefully that clears it up a little bit. So if you would like a different text to display, create a checkbox instead of a multiple choice type answer. All right, thanks guys.